everyone welcome to this video tutorial in today's video we will use these git commands in google collab to make changes in github repository the main motto of this video is to push to the github repository in real time first run this git second is we have to init the git so run this next is we are going to clone our repository that i have here this is our repository in the repository we have three files and how to clone that you know already that copy here and this is git clone and paste so run this after cloning you will get uh, this demo binary that is the repository name and all these three files now to check that uh, in which directory we are so click here run this so we are in content so for doing all the uh, git commands we have to go into the our uh, this demo binary so we will use this cd run this so we are now in demo binary next is to check what are the remote uh, verbose so run this and you will see that uh, github binary study demo binary dot git fetch and push these two origins are there now that check what is the status if you check what is the status before doing anything so you will get uh, this thing that nothing to commit there is nothing to commit and working tree is clean so now we will make some changes in our repository uh, so suppose that we want to create a new file so i am creating new file using touch and my file name is first python dot py run this command and you will see that here the new file is created refresh it first python file is created now if you want to check what is the status so run this and you will see that so we get untracked files and why it says untracked file we have to add the files to be tracked for the commit so our next command is git add dash a dash a is for uh, to add every file so run this shift enter so our all files every file is added now if you check the status then it it shows that changes to be committed and here you can see the difference between status before add and status after add now suppose that we have made some changes and uh, now we want to commit so let's make some changes in file you can see this that uh, in our repository in my file i have these three lines only these three lines and i will add fourth line and after commit and push we will see that how in github repository it is being updated and other thing you can notice that in uh, here we have four files and uh, here uh, here in github repository we have only three files so after push we will see that uh, here we will have four files here i'm printing i have added a fourth line save it and now i am going to commit so our commit command is like git commit then dash a for all files and dash m for the messes so at the time of the commit we have to write some uh, comment message so that uh, we can uh, track our changes let's run this cell 
shift enter so we have to add these two line of the codes so i have already written here so you have to give the email and you have to give the username so run this run this and you will see that our email and uh, username are added in the configuration and one more thing that we have to focus about uh, is our this main and origin so finally when we are going to push we will use main so now we have made some changes and we have created new file so now we are going to commit finally we committed now you can check what is the status so let's uh, write me the code i have committed and everything is fine now when my commit is completed now i have to push all the changes to the repository that that changes must be reflected here if you refresh this and go to my file and you will find that only three lines of the code is here but i have committed this change i have committed this change i have written four lines of the codes and i have created one more file so i have committed but it is not reflecting in the github repository so how we will do so our final goal is to push all these changes to github repository so for this thing we need our username of the github repository and password of github repository so i am using uh, for username input so i am giving my username and for the password i am using get pass to mask the password So now we have to add uh, remote login. So for that thing, we are using git remote add origin, then https username colon password at the rate github.com, then your username of the repository, and then name of the repository dot git. So run this. So it says that uh, remote origin already exists so for that what we will do we will remove the origin so run this thing and uh, the already ex existed origin will be removed now finally run again now we have to push so for the push we are using git push origin and here main if your uh, branch is master then you have to add your uh, branch name master and my branch name is main here you can see here that what is your branch you can find your branch here run this well done and finally we did now check on the github that all these changes has made in github repository or not so refresh it and yes finally you will find that i we have four files here basically we had three files and this the new file we have added and this my file we have committed so now check that whether we have made the changes yes i have added fourth line so this change is added here and finally one more command is there you can see the logs and finally i am adding this notebook to the github repository using save a copy in github so click on open. here you can see that uh, demo github notebook is added you can see that all the things that i have written in the notebook is here for your future use